like, why can't they dance? True. Like, what's wrong? Why yeah. are you so stiff out there? I'm like, I just don't know how. Yeah, I, I can't up. do it. Well, I got the secret. My my black wife unlocked the secret with me the other day. Please. You just as the drums hit, you just hit the drums, but with your feet, and you're just dancing, and it looks perfect, and you're on, and you're in rhythm. I don't know. I'm telling you, dude. I'm telling. Well, just <laughs> don't do that. Well, you also got. Oh, there's the other key too. So you can't have a tight spine. You got to hunch a little oh, bit. Oh, hunch a little. Hunch a little. That's good. Hunch a little and loosen, and then just. Look how good I look right now. Oh, that is pretty good. good. So much better. You're like, you look like bye bye bye. Yeah. <laughs> you're like one of the marionettes. That's See good. a hunch. Get a little Pocono. Can't be tight. Pocono. I'm, I hit her. I have like, a, you know, I'm, I'm like you. We have like marine posture. I'm right. Fucking, I'm up. I'm high. But yeah, she's like hunch it out. It's fucking. That's good. Like juvenile. Just met, met, right. imagine a huge chain. You're showing a camera. Okay. That's By how the way, I do. <laughs> Marines and gays greatest posture. True. It's weird. How it's got a lot of range. Gay guys can. They can. You know. Well, it's like they, any girl dance. No girls can dance bad. Everyone's like, yeah. No, my gal's a real robot. Really? Oh, my God. She's a boner yeah. out there. Really? Mine, yeah. mine, too. Really? You know her. She can't dance. She, well, Imagine I, her dancing. Well, it's like girls can... There's no move a girl... The last can, one could. The last one was really? twerking and shit. Really? Yeah, it's so hot and when a girl can dance. Yeah. Yeah, blows my mind. Tight. Well, there's no move that's kind of off. Like, girls... I was at a wedding recently, and girls are just like... Nah, okay. I don't like the... Tw- <laughs> you don't... No. Really? Your girl's twerking? That's yeah, good. You're just sitting there. You're well, like, that's what weird. What the fuck are you doing, lady? You get behind her, dude, and just fucking. No, you can't grind. Two whites you can't do... grind. Yes, you can. Yeah. No, we can't. You gotta stand totally still. Matt, just get behind please, her, you're fucking. speaking on an experience you don't sorry, have. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You're speaking I'm... on my experience no, I'm, I'm of actually... whites only I'm dating. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> WOD. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're, I apologize for that. That was insensitive. Um, but yeah, the. Um, but yeah, no, you just yeah, you just get out there and let them let them do your thing. Hunch. Yeah, Get behind them and just. Oh yeah, girl. That's what I was talking about. Yeah, girls, dog hump out on. There's no the dance bar floor. for girl. Girls can go out and just, I was watching them do like all this weird shit with their hands, and it's girls have a lot of different options that like. That's true. So like you, you know, because we don't want to look a choice. That's a choice by a girl. Yeah, we don't want to look feminine either yeah. when we're dancing. Or gay. So you, yeah, or gay. Yeah, yeah exactly. So a girl can do either. <laughs> sure, they can be. Yeah, but if gay you're too good at dancing, it's gay. Yeah, you gotta you gotta mm. straddle the line. If you're like a re- you go to a wedding and somebody's a good dancer. You gotta straddle the it's line. It's disgusting. When a straight guy's out being a good dancer. He's got moves. No, I mean like a good dancer. Like not he's, you. He's technical. <laughs> not you. I'm trying I, to spin. No, no, like, no, no, this isn't a, no, you're not. No, I hear you. I I'm hear talking you. about like technical. a dude that like, there's a circle around him and he starts dancing. And, and he does a straight. spin. Uh, they're, 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 like, oh. Well, it's like, there's like a man, there can be a manufactured aspect to it. You know what I mean? It's not coming from a place, an authentic place. It's, it's studied up. Right, yeah, I hear what you're saying, yeah, it's, it's been, yeah, yeah, you practice. He's trying for to this fuck wedding? some guys, trying to fuck all your cousins at a wedding yeah. with his dance moves. Yeah, yeah. you gotta stop. You gotta yeah. stop him. Get a or jerk. You have to just step up to him and just challenge him with like get like real gay on him on the dance yeah. floor. Yeah, I think saying. the hottest thing you can do as a guy, hey, hey, is a uh, bad dancer but owning it. I think girls like that. They're like, this guy sucks at dance, but he's so confident well, in they it. Think yeah, you he's have having fun. You do that. Yes. Like, this guy must have a huge fucking dance. Exactly. Which I don't, but <laughs> I'll, I'll get drunk enough that I'm- You seem like you got a big dick. I'm surprised. I am a hot medium. Nice. Yeah. yeah. You guys both probably you seem like probably a hot medium. Probably the same medium. dick, honestly. Ah. I feel like the blackness will get you another inch. <laughs> it might have grown. <laughs> like your, your Dude, dick I, is I was evolved. telling someone the other day, I think it fucking- I had, a, I, told, I had a dick renaissance in college, and I, I swear to God, I think it might have been that. When you made the jump, yeah, and I fully and I fully committed. I think it was just like like that little bit inside of me just <clears throat> right came out. It's yeah. a little bit just a tad, just to keep me, you know, exactly. It's evolutionary. Keep everything exactly. Keep right. everything in line. Oh, here's the other joke. We got a workshop tonight. What you got? Uh, I'm just trying to defend white women. Nice, because everybody's wild. everybody's been trashing them. Oh yeah, every single comedian You're gets stepping on. up for your like, queens. You know who's the what? Yeah, I'm like, we got to protect our white queens. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't have anything other than they were responsible. White women were responsible for Barack Obama, Seth mm. Curry, uh, Seth Curry, the basketball player, Steph Curry. I should have said, but and Seth, who's his Seth? brother. Okay, yeah. <laughs> uh, Patrick Mahomes. Who's Pretty who's good. Patrick Best quarterback oh, in the yeah. NFL. So why are they... Oh, I see what you're saying. Oh, like they gave birth to all of them. Good Drake. Point. Drake and that guy And Obama's the best one. Chance. Yeah. I thought you were saying they voted for Obama. No, no, no. I thought uh, so True. Too. I should have... I won't start with him. Yeah. True. Maybe yeah. start with Wayne Gretzky. And Obama's dad <laughs> left and she raised him. It's all white lady. Anyway, and then ended so by being like... So you're bringing this out there making Obama's no good fucking dad. <laughs> no, I'm not saying that part. <laughs> <laughs> 
You see, I got, there's something there. You got something there. I defending, like defending your white queens. Defending is white queens is funny, and then and then at the end being like, also lay off them. They're dumb as hell. <laughs> True. <laughs> like back off. They're fucking idiots. Yeah. They right. just got out of the house like 40 years ago. True. 30 years ago. They were dumb as hell. They, they have no idea what they're doing. They out were there. incubated for sure. They're going around yelling at people, there screaming, crying. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Completely... They were incubated heavily, dude. Oh yeah. yeah. They're like homeschooled kids. <laughs> I completely and agree also, with white it. guys are that we're we're doing a very good job of being like, yeah, it's them, right? Meanwhile, literally, we do. It's white guys. We've been backstabbing <laughs> each other. Well, the they white were guys. Quiet. No, I'm saying girls and guys. Well, we did horrible shit. They were quiet. Yeah, and true. So they were like accomplices. But I still don't want them flying planes. <laughs> true that. All right, I don't Joker. think there's anything there. No, no, I, I like I that. Think I like That's that. It. You got like something. We'll get, it. we'll get it fired up. Yeah, yeah. There's something. Dude, I had, not, I had an idea end. for a because um, I was thinking about how. Inherently, and I, and I, I, I do like I, you know, I, I guess people get mad at this, but I think <laughs> women instinctively, and I, and I think this is real, and not maybe it's you know, obviously like maybe ten out of a hundred this doesn't apply to, but they they like they're trying to design a house, and their whole or their plans have to do with like the life within like a net, like it's a whole nesting thing, so it's not really they're not on a con, not like a conquest thing. They want to set up a headquarters. So and it's like a lot of them, but they need a dude to do it. Yeah. So they need a dude. They're trying to build a nest. They need a nest, but, but they need a dude. But the girls that don't get the dude, who don't get the nest, I was yeah. like, we got to start figuring out a thing to do with them because they're causing problems. They're the women without homes? Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> I was thinking of starting a orphanage. Just whores. Orphanage, yeah. dude. A you start up a orphanage, dude, and you just fucking, you give them like Have social Have you been media. to an apartment in New York with like <laughs> three women? Oh. That's a orphanage. orphanage they're all dude. whores. But you got to take care of them, dude. You got to take care of them. And you got to give them like, you, like you get them together. You give them like bot Instagram followers, or in their head they're like, oh, I'm fucking those videos. They'll video themselves all day and be like, I've been videoing myself all day. Really? It's TikToks. You're doing TikToks? Of course you. No, I mean I've been watching them. Yeah, but you know, oh, these yeah. These beautiful you, dude, women. You'd be nasty on TikTok. True. Yeah. <laughs> do, do this. It's Hunch. this. Hunch. Yeah. But yeah, I was thinking about that, man. It's like, and as soon as women are like, that's not true. It's like everyone busts out their phones. Let's see who has plans. On whatever that yeah, thing Pinterest. is, Pinterest. Mm. One group of us has like has like ninety living rooms in their phone. Yeah, go. They're nesters, bro. They're all they're just trying to build a nest, and they need a dude. They would hate hearing this. They would, but, but it's true. you got something. I don't I think, think they hate. They're, they're, I think they their know. Their whole world. They all have Pinterest of their wedding, their like, house. They, this room, they come in. They just. Yeah. True. <laughs> They want to put on overalls and splash one line of paint on, and then call yeah. a contract. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I tried, <laughs> but yeah, no. The um, but I was thinking about that. I'm like, just a little tip into the you know. Well, they're in a tough psychology. spot. You're right because it's like girl power, independent, all this shit. And but then you're like, they're like, I like baking, but I can't let yeah. them know yeah. I like baking because that's like a traditional yep. gender role thing. But you still like it, and then you uh, want you guys, a kid, but you're not supposed to. You say gotta you leave the kid. city. But they got to banish. They're all women. But the sex home. The they're women. Sex in the city. Psyop them, dude. Sex in the city. Did the women in cities are out of control. You leave the city. They're all like, oh, yeah, chill. let's get married at twenty three. Well, I'm the, ready to start a family. Yeah, let's have five fucking kids, three right. dogs. True, but then at Sex in the City, the whole it all culminated in Mr. Big. He was the star of Sex in the City. What, what was I don't remember. Mr. Big was the I guy. I just remember who jerking off up. to the one sex scene <laughs> every week. Mr. Big snatched up SJP. Who so, I think is hot. What do you think of her? SJP. I think is hot. When I was yeah, a kid, man. I loved her. SJP. Me too. Is hot. I was I was so into that crazy lady. mug. Yeah, the horse. But it's, yeah, yeah, but it's she. She can pull crazy it off. Mug. <laughs> I mean, she's got a wild, wild face. Yeah, it's almost Medusa like. Yeah, but it but works. It entranced me. Yeah, yeah. she's got the mole too. Dick hard. Yeah. I didn't even notice she had a mole. I was just just going through that fucking like maze like face. I couldn't. Yeah. I didn't even True. see the mole. I didn't, even, I didn't even get to that. I'm still in, like the center right of her face. And she's uh, yeah. just talking about being a slut the whole time. Yeah. Yeah. It's great. Just laying in a bed, typing laying on a fucking it, oh. keyboard. And I hate to admit it, but men like women putting clothes on and trying on shit. That's what TikTok is. Yeah, just yeah, like, oh, yeah. look at her outfit. Look at her outfit. I mean, which dude, sounds super yeah. millions gay, of views. Millions. Just watching. Because that's all you want to do it when you go out is stare at a girl, but you can't just, you got to like look away. Yeah, yeah. But that's what we want to do. So that's what TikTok is great. You're Your TikTok. Like, I get to stare at this girl in her outfit. The TikTok True. algorithm. <laughs> nice. TikTok algorithm has discovered that I am a pedophile. Really? Oh, it's, it's all right. It's trying me. to break you down. It's trying to make me a pedophile, dude. I mean, is it? What do they? Do they give you? They should give you age stamps. Well, it just it just looks at how long you watch each video. So yeah. of course, if it's a hot chick, I'm gonna watch the whole video. True. And then yeah. 
So is, now, it, is there now, anything to I stop? If I turn on TikTok right now, it'll be a hot college shit. You got to throw well, a, a Family Guy clip in there every now and then just to balance it out. Yeah, true. Was is there anything on TikTok to stop like like say like fourteen year olds take videos of themselves? Is, uh, dude, did they I have an algorithm think, to like stop girl, that from getting to you. There was a girl that was so hot, and then. <laughs> One of her videos was like, "Here are my prom pictures." Oh, I was just like, "Dude, no, what, are you doing? what is going? On? I'm not doing it." No, I'm saying TikTok. TikTok sending me these yeah. beautiful angels. Did, and that that was it. It wasn't like and then, but like that was a flash, like a throwback Thursday. I mean, not. I don't want to throw anybody under the bus, but this must have been exactly what actual real life was for Delia. Oh, right. yeah. <laughs> like every day, right. it must have been real life TikTok where he's like fucking a chick, and she's like, "Here's my prom photos." It's like, ah, <laughs> shit. Yeah. Oh man, you gotta do not, it. look. You not, gotta do a due deal. You gotta get when you get to that level. <laughs> you need a private eye to like suss everybody out, get their ages, and yeah. then be like, and then if they're sixteen, then you you maintain a relationship. <laughs> that's, grooming. <laughs> yeah. that's grooming. That's grooming. Well, it should be like Tinder, where you can put the ages like. 18 to 28, you know, yeah. and that's what you see on TikTok. We're like 18 to party. 21 to answer. Yeah, like 16 to party. Yeah. <laughs> like we can just vibe. We can vibe. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's, dude, a, that's, sorted, a, that's a sorted business. I've been vibing too much, dude. I've been vibing you like crazy. Vibe. It's a sorted business. Vibing, it's a sorted business, dude. <laughs> I'll show you. I'll show you guys There's, that. Well, the problem you is, is no, 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 you no. got to get dads. Well, they're not like, I don't think they're that young. I have no idea how who, old who any knows? of these girls are. Who knows? You got to get dads. It's the dad's fault. Dad's got to get on TikTok, show their daughters. Like, if you see this woman and you like her shit, I'm going to find you and yeah. fuck you up. Mm. Just get a dad, like, just fucking have guns and be like, you think my daughter's fucking hot, you sick fucking pervert? You know, if I yeah. see you liking her shit, I'm going to come for you. Look, this is her. This is her in a bikini, dude. Yeah. Don't even fucking Don't look. Don't hard you at all. sick motherfuckers, dude. Wow. This was her mom when she was 17, <laughs> dude. <laughs> that's one. That's, one. that's a category now. A hot mom. And then they're like, she found this old tape of herself. And then they use the old filter of an oh. old camera. And it's a hot daughter. The girls dance. are perverts, bro. It's crazy. Girls are sick perverts, dude. They're tricking me every night. They're trying to get you in the nest, dude. They're luring you, dude. <laughs> they don't want me in the nest, dude. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> they don't want us in the Farts nest. Farts and snores. Right. Hey, man, they're trying to get you in the nest. It's... Here's my hot mom. They're showing you like, yeah, this is what I'll turn into. And. Let me just paint a fucking wall. Yeah, they do need to paint. <laughs> just paint. I can't. I've been renting. I'm not They're fucking to paint. reverse Tom Sawyer. <laughs> That's all they are. They're trying to trick someone into letting them paint. Yeah. They're a bunch of N word gyms. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's tough. It's not applicable to the thing, but it's very funny. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's like my favorite. That's my favorite, Louie. Oh, yeah. he's like Mark Twain said: "If you never tell a lie, you don't have to remember the truth, or whatever." And then he's like, "But Mark Twain also said yeah. there once was a guy named." <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. What a joke! Oh, Great he's the king, man. Whatever happened to that guy? <laughs> so good. He's around. Yeah, man. But the, yeah, that's, uh, you know, I mean, I'm saying all this respectfully, but it seems to be the way. It seems to be the facts I've been picking up. Yeah, yeah, and they don't like the facts. No, <laughs> they don't like facts. I'm like, I'm just going off what I'm seeing, and they're like, "Fuck you, I'll kill you." Like, Why are you mad at me? I'm just saying. Wait, what who I'm... are you talking about? Women. Oh, okay. Most groups. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wait, I'm which just... group are we on right now? Yeah, I'm just saying what I saw the other day, and they're like, "Ah, true." Maybe you're so mad because we got something here. <laughs> Maybe we're on to the case. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> yeah they don't like when, you, when you suss them out. It's yeah, they get. Very cornered. Right. It's like when they're like, you can't generalize a group. We're all different. And then they go on stage like, white people like mayonnaise and yoga and all yeah. that. And you're like, I thought we couldn't generalize. So that that one's that one's true, but the other ones aren't. What's it's, tough about it is that's the only group you can generalize about. Right. Left. So every white comic's going on stage and be like, white guys. Yes. <laughs> like, yes. it's the only one we got left. It, you just filter the Adele, one Do you want to works. paint a wall? Paint a wall? Yeah. Is that like kind of a dream for you? It's to paint a house? Uh, yeah, she's lying, denial. lying right through her teeth right Clear now. Clear denial. <laughs> she has no idea. <laughs> Sorry. You know what else was a tough one? Is the uh, like you, you, you should over two with Adele today. That was bad. Uh, that she was wants fun. a nest. What are you kidding? Come oh, yeah. on, dude, she's come looking on. for a, a, a pile of sticks. She's probably crying right now, dude. <laughs> Perfect. I've laid the trap. Now I get to go out and console her. <laughs> dude, you're a sick ticket, dude. You know that. Damn. You just wanted to break her down. You got to break them down. True. You yeah. Build them up. That's true. I'm sorry, baby. Long game. Beautiful. Yeah, I was watching. A, I was watching. <laughs> is, I was watching a, uh, one of those like I, I, I watch a lot of. You, what's up? <laughs> Not, 
It's not nice. This is fun. This is fun. Yeah. This, will, this will age well. Like for the, you know, oh, three years. Oh, this will go really like good for us. 40 years from now, they'll oh, be like, yeah. damn, dude, you're a fucking These guys granddad. are ahead of their time, dude. Yeah, once women, now they know that trick, once the women have girls. regressed in the next 40 years <laughs> back to their place, they'll be like, damn, these guys called it. I can't believe they called it. <laughs> now they're going to kick it. Dude, they run the world, bro. Are you kidding me? They do kick they ass. They run the fucking world. They're kick ass as hell. I like, dude, I, like whenever I see women, I like I shudder. Like sometimes I just look at them, like what the fuck? I'm like, how powerful? I'm sorry, man. You guys just kick so much. But didn't you have that dude. experience when they when she gave birth though? You watch your wife. Well, Isn't that the yeah, one thing? That's, that's the one thing nuts. that guys usually switch over, and they're like, they are strong. This that was yeah. insane. Well, it was like I was crying. You saw it. <laughs> well, I was it, I was on the other end because it was like the oh the face I, end. Yeah, the baby had the umbilical cord around her neck, so they had a. Do the old fucking oh, lynching. Open it up. Yeah, open it up. Yeah, they had it three times. I had it, dude. You, you're sorry, I, sorry. I had three. I had it too. Comedy podcast. I had it too. I had I had it wrapped. It's genetic. We so did I. So did I. Did you really? Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah, bro. A lot of, yeah, a lot of the, Maybe it's a comedy thing. I think so. I think that deprivation of oxygen early on just. Yeah, I was, was a C section. I was a C section yeah. too. I was a unit. Re- oh, oh big ass baby you're, pro- you're probably out. you're probably fucking like rocky dude on her abdominal wall just fucking uh, uh. yeah they cut me out early they're like get rid of this thing <laughs> this thing's already six two but yeah they, it was like they came up with a bud light <laughs> it was terrible the whole experience is terrifying and i don't know if they go in it, it's of course fucked up they go into like it's like it's like two days before they're like i'm fucking hot and you're like Shut the fuck up. and then <laughs> and then they're like <laughs> Fucking their abdo- their stomach's here and they're cut. And you know, I was like, eh. and they're like, she's like, you'll be soon to be okay. And I'm like, how are you champing this, dude? Yeah. How are you champing yeah. this? It was. You and me have a tough time with mushrooms. Yeah, it was. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he's getting sliced open. That's the one thing you see and you're just like, holy fuck. Ew. And then, and then like, you're like, dude, you don't ever have to do that again. And like two weeks later, they're like, I want another baby. And you're like, what? Isn't that wild? What? But it's, you know, been going on for, obviously, generations and generations. And, it's and, the oldest time. Uh, true. And a, a big part of pregnancy is called nesting. Oh. So that, that's a thing. They start, like, they'll start, like, rearranging. It's actually pretty sweet. They'll, like, just deck your house out. Your house becomes, like, super organized and laid out. Mm. Broke my nose in two fucking places, dude. You would have loved it, too. I would have. I mean, I was delighted when you dude. showed me, when you sent me the picture, when you told me what happened. It was... I actually I, was laughing very hard, and then I stopped, and I was like, well, "I hope he's all right." Like, I was fine. I was, no, I was. I was like, "Are you all right?" I like, knew yeah, how fine. funny was it like, was. Ah, as soon as I was yeah, on yeah, an, yeah. in an Uber on the way to the hospital, I went, "That was kind of funny." It looks fine. Yeah, it's all right. Let me see it. Yeah, you can't really see it that much. Hold on, get a better look. <laughs> yeah, you see it. <laughs> you weren't lying. It's it's ref- it's like going back to where it was, but my septum, I, dude. I went to the ear, nose, and throat guy yesterday. He remembered. He goes, you were at 25%, dude. He's like, you're at five right now. And I went, son of a bitch. Damn it. He's like, Cut me. He had, this, he had the same. Uh, it was funny. I went to the ear, nose, and throat guy yesterday. And he has the same last name as my mom. Like, mother's maiden yeah. name. I'm not going to say what it is for you freaks. You can hack my credit cards. My mother's name, maiden name. The <laughs> ultimate key to all my fucking kingdom. Too. What was the first pet you ever owned? A dog. What was his name? Sharky. <laughs> 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 what was my childhood best friend? Yeah. Oh, shit. Spilling the secrets. The uh, yeah. So I was like chatting this guy up. Like I knew that we had the same surname thing going on. So I was like hitting him with like kin. I was talking to this guy. And he oh, he's a kin folk. Kin folk. He didn't know. I'm gonna. I still haven't told him. I'm gonna tell him right before I go on the knife. I say, look, we're kin. Don't Better fuck this up. We're kin folk. Kill me, dude. Dude, I'm go. Yeah. So he uh, I was with him yesterday. He goes, bro, you're at like 25. percent You're at like five now. Yeah. You know, and I actually floated a couple theories. I was like, dude, is it true that different nostril breathing? activates different hemispheres of the brain he just went no <laughs> i was like fair enough and i waited dude then he goes he goes actually now that you say that he goes there's a guy i like whose work i've always followed closely he's like super renowned he did write something about like activating different areas of the brain he's just being polite he's like no he goes it's not you're not ox- <laughs> he's not you're not bringing polite. oxygen to it but there is activation but he goes i read that and thought like that was a weird thing for this guy to publish but he goes so maybe i don't know so he left it at that he was being polite no, this guy was dude. He's being polite. He said he goes no, and then he was like, "Well, I shouldn't have been no, that he harsh." Waited. He, no, and he, he waited. waited a couple minutes and was like, "Actually, I'm telling you, you know, this I is my have heard something like that." Me and this guy are basically <laughs> two people. We're kin. We're related. We're cousins, dude. And our surname also means warrior when you translate it, dude. Oh. Now people crack the code. Yeah, find out my mother's your mother's maiden name's Guerrero. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mother's maiden name is Nancy Plaskin. (laughs) 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 Mother's maiden name is Gentle Lady from Vermont. (laughs) They're not called gentle ladies, dude. They're called fucking girls, dude. Yeah, fucking women. Yeah. Lady. Hey, fucking lady. (laughs) Yeah, hey, lady. Make it quick. Okay, she's done talking. Erase that from the record. (laughs) Just while she's talking. You don't have to type. You don't have to type. You're wasting your time typing. She's just being, she's just mad. Just let her fucking talk. Ugh. The, uh, no, dude. So then talking to this bro, he's get, dude, he started telling me what they're going to do. To, first of all, I broke my nose and fucking body surfing to the bros. Dude, I, I had my family <laughs> gathered to watch me. I said, this is going to be inspirational to my kids. Took in a wave. Maya wasn't paying attention. She cried because I came off. Did you see that? She goes, I missed it. I was like, don't worry. Dude, I'll get out there and do it again. Big wave comes. You know when you see a big wave, but there's a bigger one behind it? I yeah. Went, Everyone thinks I'm crazy. All the boogie boarders are, why is this guy not taking this? You should have taken shit. this. This is a sick wave. I said, you guys can't see the one I'm seeing. Let that one go. It's me out there. Big at Bigger waves coming. A lot of times there's a second bigger wave coming. I mean, I've studied ocean patterns forever. I'm like RFK Jr. We document all this stuff. I have a journal. I've done- <laughs> so I'm sitting there. I hate you. <laughs> I hate you. Yeah, my little notebook. <laughs> so the wave comes. I fucking, I paddle as fast as I can. I say, please don't let me miss this wave in front of my kids. Dude, I time it perfectly. I'm watching boogie boarders just lose themselves in the bubbles. I'm fucking ripping on this thing. Dude. <laughs> I go to pop my head. I'm about to hot dog. So I pop my head out the water. You're hot dogging to look for your kids. Periscope while oh, riding yeah. the wave. I did it already that week. Periscoping out to look for the kids. As I pop my head out of the water, it just felt like I hit a brick wall. I look and there's a 12-year-old girl sitting there. And I come out, I come out of the water. I didn't even know it yet. I look like fucking sloth. Dude. I'm like, <laughs> my nose is all the way over here. I was like, are you okay? And the girl's like, yeah, I'm fine. I was like, what the fuck did I hit then? Brittany thinks that she let go of her boogie board. And as the she like the, well, the wave is so fucking tubular, I guess she bailed yeah. on it. She tried to catch like the little currents of it, bailed on it, let it go. And I as I came up, the boogie board thwacked That's me the with theory. the hard plastic bottom. But I'm telling you, it felt like I hit like a wall. So I think the boogie board shelved in the water, Ooh. and I was pushing against like a stable, yeah, like, a yeah, stable yeah. side of it because there was no give to this fucking thing. But who, no one will ever know. It's a mystery. Forever will be a mystery. Could have been Poseidon's trident, dude. I think Poseidon struck Poseidon's you down, dude. He, fucking... he saw how arrogant you were getting with the periscope. <laughs> he said, you will not periscope on my snarly waves. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, broke it. No, lifeguards checked me out, and they were like, that's fucked. And then a, yeah. they were like, hold on, we have a medic. A guy came, and he was like, yo, dude, do you want us to call an ambulance? And my wife goes, yes. And I was like, fucking no. Absolutely yeah. fucking not. And dude, my there was a part where it was really cool where like, I'm totally fucked. And there was that part of me that was like, what if like a fucking sliver of my bone sitting in my brain right now and I could die at any second, dude. So I was like, we got to hurry up. I was dealing with like, I could have a bone in the perfect spot in my brain that if I move a certain way, I die. I also don't believe that. You know, yeah. I remember that when we were kids. Yeah, I know. They would talk about if you hit someone in yes, the nose. I do. I don't I, think that's true. I lived it. I fully was like, yeah. if you get hit hard enough in the nose, your nose don't get me wrong. Your brain. If it happened to me, I'd be like, I think that's <laughs> definitely true. I, know. I I had it. it I was, don't have the my nose bone. I think just hit, just slid out of my brain. I'm living like, right now with no consequence of that being true or not. I thought so I was like, going to be Phineas Gage. Remember Phineas Gage? Yeah. I Took thought a I was, fucking rail to the fucking dome. Yeah, I thought I was like, I probably went through my prefrontal cortex. I'm fucked. I don't know. Whatever it did, it jarred something loose. You're flying today. You're doing great. Just mushrooms. I think it made you. Yeah. Oh, you <laughs> mushrooms and coffee. coffee. Although you know what happened though? After the accident, I was I went to play pool and I was nasty at pool. You might be. It might have made you even better. I think so. It might have made you even. I was better at everything. I was hoping to God I hit my nose back over the other way so that my deviated septum would oh. work. When I came out and I finally saw it, it was a crowd of that side. I said, that's the last thing I need. That was the last thing I need. I already had a deviated septum. Dang dude, it. Dude, I, I was sitting there. My daughter was, Brittany was scared. The, the fucking medic was like, Jesus fucking Christ. And I watched my daughter's lips start to tremble. Total steeled up and was like, I'm fine. I'm driving to the hospital. Totally steeled up. Yeah, you have to. I was proud of that. You have totally to. Totally steeled up. The guys, like, well, come on, we'll get an ambulance. I don't need a fucking ambulance. I was like, Maya, I'm fine. Get a totally fucking fine. ambulance. Yeah, I'm like, I don't need a fucking ambulance. Or no. A He's like, well, you might be dizzy. I'm like, yeah, I'm fucking dizzy. I just got whacked my fucking. Yeah, head. I had a concussion in front yeah. of my family. So then I said, he goes, you shouldn't drive. I said, like, I'll get an Uber then. So I yeah. got wet and it's almost Uber. <laughs> <laughs> 
The dude was the man. Can you take me to the hospital? <laughs> dude, I just had a gauze on my face and a towel and a bathing suit. And I brought a tank top so I wanted to be shirtless. No shirt, no problem in the hospital. Salt Life Hospital. But dude, I go in there. Yeah. And it was just me and a fucking pregnant lady. So there's a lady about to give birth. The hospital's so shitty there, dude. They're, everyone was very nice. But like a lady was there. Like the doctors like co- just come like they schedule births. Like I guess they were cutting her open yeah. or whatever. And uh, she waited for like seven minutes for someone to come. I was like sitting there with my nose and I was like, maybe she's just having like birth pain. She's pretty far along. So then I was like, do you want to go? And she's like, no, no, no. So I went up and I was like, all right. And I'm like, you know, let me get seen. And then they were like, oh, we're bringing you up for a birth. And I'm like, what the fuck? Why did like take this lady back? Yeah. It was crazy. But then, then they, no, she was probably like, you have a deviated septum. Go. <laughs> you need, I mean, to be, fair, is urgent. <laughs> to be fair, I went back to get triage. There was four nurses and they all went. Oh my god! And I was like, "You guys, please be professionals. Please stop this." About the septum or the broken yeah, my nose? nose. My <laughs> nose. Know. They were fucking the whole time going like, like "You're a five percent." I was still, jo- I was still joking with the lady. They I'm were- surprised they didn't fucking hit you with the, the oh. charges, dude. You were, uh, you were about done, bro. I had four ladies. You think they would have, dude? <laughs> they, you know, they got to ask me med- personal medical questions, to which I got to respond, "Hell no, babe." Next question about what. It's like, do you ever get this? I said, to get a what? <laughs> Not this guy. Let's keep it moving. What do you mean? They're asking me about certain injectables, and if I got them, and I said, the what? Oh, they asked if you got the vaccine. They asked, and I, I said this. Why? I don't know. They always ask you. It's like, you guys don't hype. They're just hyping me up, so I get to go, Psst, nah. <laughs> yeah. Psst, that one? <laughs> nah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I said, does, for the record, it doesn't mean I'm anti-vax. That's very weird. They ask that. They ask you all the fucking time still, dude. Because I think they want to, they like try to get you still. They'll be like, "Do you want it?" It's like, no. Yeah. No. Yeah, I'll get it now. <laughs> I'm still waiting. I'd like to get it now. I'd like to get blood clots now, dude. R.I.P. Tor- or Tori Kelly's not R.I.P. She's still alive, but Tori Who's Kelly. That? She's a singer. She's fucking like 30 years old. Blood clots hospital. Which again, who knows what caused blood clots? But I've never. Because sometimes when things happen, the news does make it seem like they're happening more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But also, like, dude, did people ever get blood clots like this? It's fucking weird. I'm with you. But either way, you know, who knows? We're Ooh, just it does It does feel like some severe weather's headed this way. Hold on. Let me check my nose. The lady said I'm going to start feeling it in my God nose. Fucking <laughs> damn it, dude. <laughs> that yeah, I can detect weather. <laughs> God <laughs> damn it, dude. dude. It, was my, it was literally my dream. I, I think I still might be dreaming. Four ladies were like, that's so gnarly. I was like, it's nothing. Like, did you get the vax? I went, Nah, it was yeah, tough guy. I was in tough guy. That's heaven. about as cool as it gets. I was in yeah. tough guy heaven, dude. It was the best, dude. God, what's it's nothing more shameful when somebody's like, "Did you get it?" It's like, <laughs> yeah, I had to. <laughs> yeah, but that was equally, so embarrassing. To be fair, it was equally brave. I was so afraid of it, dude. And for me, it was less scary not to get it. I was, I was so scared. Mine was of it. full lazy. I was just like, yeah, I'll get it if it. But I got to walk over to Dwayne Reed. That's like three blocks. <laughs> that was funny. The seller called. The guy called. The manager there. The owner there was like, "You gotta get. You it. gotta get. You're the only. You're like it's. It was just me and like four black comics that were like, we're not getting it, <laughs> <laughs> and we don't trust the government. And he forced you. Yeah, and he forced you. Man. Uh, kind of. He was like, you got to get it. He can't work here. I was like, fine. I'll go get it right now. Yeah. I you don't just care. got in there too. Yeah. I was like, I'll just get it. Yeah. Fuck it. Well, at least he didn't. Thank God he didn't fucking. I only got one. I never got to follow up. That was kind of that's kind of G shit. That's bad boy shit. That's G shit. I got one so I could get it past the club. And then shout I... out to G shit. Gardini only got one. I filled out the other half of his card for G block baby. Just write these letters in your card. Fucking allegedly. Pushing. Yeah. Bro, it's I was safe, solo. Safe. Patriots are in the fucking power. There's a lot right of Patriots right, right now in complete X. control. Can't wait for fucking X, dude. X Twitter. X Twitter, dude. dude no, it's, it's not Twitter. Nuts. X Twitter. X. It's just X. I'm going to buy everything on X. It's going to be a marketplace, dude. It's going to be a marketplace? I'm stoked on it, dude. I I can't stand people hating on Musk, Musk dude. If you would have saw what I saw. You saw the Starlink. I saw Starlinks, dude. If you see Starlink, you go, actually, Musk is God. Oh, by the way, he's just trying to make the internet free for everybody, too. Yeah. He's trying to give Africans fucking Wi-Fi. Please, God, let them. Do, please. Please, please let, them let the Wi-Fi. Africans get Wi-Fi, dude. Please make our job 50 times easier so we can bring up clips of those dudes doing funny stuff, dude. They're going to be the funniest guys possible. <laughs> huh? That's going to be tough to compete with. African they, podcasts. Bro? I think those guys got some real issues. We get to lay around 
complained about shit. Those guys, those African fellas, I think they got some real problems. Yeah, I mean, true. I wouldn't wish that on my, you know, starving or deviated septum on my worst enemy. <laughs> deviated. I look as a sufferer myself. True. What's your journey been like? My journey has been so hard. It's a deviated septum. Yeah, I think I don't even. I never think about it. I'm stoked, dude. I'm gonna have plugs in my nose. I oh, dude. So I got to tough guy heaven with the ladies. And tough guy like, heaven was. They're like, how are you not freaking out? And I said, guys, when your daughter looks at you with a tremble and lip, and they said, oh, you were, you were being brave. You're like, being a good daddy. Yeah, pretty much. And like that's so. So I was just like, dude, this can this just go on forever? Then I went. I just sat in the back. What of the do thing. these nurses look like? Uh, three black ladies, one white lady. Old white lady. It's like old white, old scarecrow white lady. Three just pleasantly, just kind of like rotund black lady nurses, and it was just perfect, dude. I I just was perfect. It looks like they, someone painted them in that triage, dude. It was beautiful. yeah, beautiful. They were just fucking. You're so strong and tough and calm, and I was. Yes. Yes, I guess I am. Yes, I guess I am the coolest fucking dude you guys ever fucking met. Yeah, I, I tried this. to let that pregnant lady go in front of me. I don't know if you guys noticed that. I felt so bad. <laughs> When I just was like, yeah, she's fine. I was like, I need my <laughs> It hurts. She's not that far along. Yeah, yeah I'd be seen first. I'm not waiting behind her. <laughs> yeah, it was sick. It was uh, it was very fun. I got back and they were just like, it's broken into. I, I thought they were going to snap it into place so I could complete tough guy heaven and be like, do it. Do it. You're yeah. Like it's broken into places, your nose bones floating. And I was like, oh, that sounds scary. <laughs> Can it still go in my brain yet or what? Is that done? And then just went home. Went home. That was it. Is your bone still floating? Yeah, man. I just have a bone not attached to anything. That's why they're able to tomorrow. So the fucking nose doctor was like, yeah, we're going to a piece of metal and just kind of bend that thing forward uh, and pry it up. And then we'll go out and cut out your cartilage in your nose and we'll straighten it out. Dude, don't tell me. And reinsert it into your nose. And then we'll they're going to stuff me up with two plugs. So I'll just have a plugged up nose for six days. And at the end, end of the That's six gonna days, fucking annoying. it's going to suck so bad because you know I love to breathe through my nose. I have to plug, unplug them. And then it's like, dude, and then they, fucking I pull him out on that sixth day and then it's on. But he said your septum can naturally curve again. And they got to cut me one in a hundred chance. I can lose all it's feeling in my one, top, though. my front teeth, which I'm like, fucking don't care. He's like, the septum can curve. And I told him, I said, dude, for, when you're on that, when I'm on that table, forget aesthetics. I want pure functionality. So you got to cut little gills in the side of my nose. Give it to me, dude. I want Please. total functionality. Don't worry about what my nose looks. If it comes down, if you have to make a choice between functionality or aesthetics, I want you to err on the side of fucking functionality, please. Of course. The guy's just like... You're the first guy who's ever said this. We're fucking cousins, bro. (laughs) We're fucking cousins. Dude, I was leaning into tough guy shit. I had double black eyes at the beach, so I was like walking to places and just be like... (laughs) These guys think I'm so fucking tough. I just thought you were a crackhead. I know. With my family. This is a good-looking homeless guy. (laughs) Got <laughs> two black eyes. Yeah, broken boogie boarding. <laughs> yeah, body surfing. Oh, body surfing. Right, dude. Imagine it's a, a fuck. fucking deviated septum and a boogie boarding rash. That's, that would have been hell. That boogie boarding rash is nobody can know. I, yeah, <laughs> that's tough. <laughs> that would have sucked. They would have rushed you in the ER. Oh, dude, if I had a boogie boarding rash, I'd be like, yeah. you guys think this nose is bad? Check how red my stomach is. <laughs> my dude. belly is. I knew I should have went in and put my rash guard on, but I didn't. 